The, uh, the you know the, first, the 15 practices obviously culmination day of the spring game. Uh, the main thing when you come out here is you want to stay healthy for one, and, and we did that. Two, you want to see how guys show up in front of a crowd. We had some guys do some good things today. We still got a ways to go, but I thought I think our team has bought into what we're trying to do uh, with our program and the values that we believe in. We still have a, a long way to go. This summer is going to be very important to our growth, but um, the 15 have been good. We we stayed healthy fit for the most part. Uh, didn't uh, I was hoping to establish the you know a starting quarterback through the 15. We didn't get that accomplished, so that'll go into this offseason or the summer into the fall. But um, we got a good foundation laid, and then uh, hopefully we'll continue to build off of it. Installing a new offense this uh, spring, how do you feel the guys have picked up on it? Yeah, well, you know we were very slow and deliberate with it. Uh, we probably only put about 60% of it in, and so uh, we're getting strides. But then you also see there's some things we still got to work on. But uh, I think they're understanding what, what we're trying to do. They just need more reps and more experience of it. Uh, now that they know what we do, uh, now that they can do player-led stuff, I think that I think this the summer seven on sevens and the summer things will be very important for our, our continued development on offense. You know, coach, talk a little bit about the defense. I mean, it seemed like they were just pretty uh, all over the place today. How do you feel about how they're able to do that field? I think we got a chance to be good defensively. Uh, we've got some good uh, good uh, players in some key spots. Uh, my worry is some depth. We don't have a lot of depth in certain places, and so uh, we've got to find a way. We got to find a way there to continue to build that depth. But we got a chance to be good there uh, if they can, uh, you know, eliminate some of the uh, inconsistencies they play with. How's it feel? You know, just kind of like your first go around with this. How do you personally feel being out here and amongst your guys and getting the spring game? Well, it, it, it was good. You know, anytime, <laughs> you know, anytime you, you're first time doing stuff, you wonder how guys are gonna. Uh, perform or handle themselves with with the crowd. Normally, you know, we we don't have many people at our practices, but uh, you know, we're in a good place, good place there. We we know we have to, as from a coaching staff, we know we got to get better, and we will. Uh, it's a for us, it's you know, it's a long play. I'm not going to rush the process. I know we want to we want to win, and we want to win right away. We're competing for a championship right away, but I got to make sure we don't try to skip steps. And so uh, we we laid a good foundation, and now we got to continue to pour it. Kyle and a lot of new pieces. And I would imagine that's the deal in college football now. You have to deal with it. How do you gel them in what is a short amount of time? Almost 30 new players. Well, uh, it's hard, and, and we're not completely there. We got to, we've got to. You lay your foundation of who you want to be, and you got to hold them to that standard every day. Uh, and uh, I, I think they're understanding that. We'll probably be adding more now. Now you got your freshmen coming in. If there's any portal guys coming in, so there's more to do. So it's it's never ending. Uh, what you hope happens is the ones that uh, have bought into it. Anybody new that's coming in, they got to say, "This is how you got to do things." And um, we're not where I want to be on that, but we're we're a lot farther along than I thought we would be. Kylan Austin's a young receiver. Had a good day today. Seems like he had a good spring as well. He does. Kylan's one of one of our guys that actually can really really go and run. Uh, you know, Kylan Kylan can really be a really good player for us in this league. Kylan's got to get consistent with catching the ball when he when he has the opportunities there. Uh, and just being consistent of, of uh, running the right routes when he's supposed to. He had a touchdown today, didn't run a route, and so. But uh, he did improve, and if he'll continue to to uh, you know buy into things, he's he he has the talent, and the tools to do that. And the portal opens today. What are some positions you'll be looking at uh, as you navigate that process? Well, uh, you know we we'll see what happens in the next few days with us. We're we're, we're obviously gonna have people go in. We know that. Uh, maybe some that have already told us. Maybe some surprises, uh, and then. Uh, you know, we, we've got it from a defensive standpoint. We've got to get uh, some D linemen and linebackers from a depth standpoint, and then offensively, uh, offensive line wise, we got to improve there. I'd like to get a couple receivers, and and uh, we probably still look for a, uh, a quarterback. To be honest, Coach, if you don't mind, you gave us some awards there. Jalen Jimerson got one of those awards. I mean, what have you seen out of him so far, and the role that you're looking to put him in? I thought Jalerson, uh, Jalen, Jamerson, Jalerson, Jamison. Uh, Jalen, I keep coming. I, uh, you got me screwed up. I thought uh, I thought he really had a good spring. You know, when when you come into a new place, certain you know you might say, oh, this kid here. You know, you might hear certain things, and he's he's done really well for us. You know, and and uh, I guess from what my expectations were, at least what I was led to believe, he's uh, really overcome those and did well. And so uh, I think he solidified an opportunity to, to be a heavy contributor for us. What do you feel about the growth of your offensive line this spring? I, I think they. Uh, you know, we've got a lot of older guys there, and then we had, you know, one of our returners, Avi, got hurt, missed all the spring, and so it allowed it allowed some young guys to get some some quality reps, uh, and I, I think that uh, they're going to be the backbone of our offense right now because they, uh, regardless, they have so much more experience than anybody else. No matter if it's a new offense, it's O line, you know. So uh, they're going to have to be our backbone and help carry us early on, 
until uh, we get you know better confidence and better play out of the positions, you know, skill positions. Anybody else? Pretty good. Thank y'all. Thanks, Thanks, Thanks for your time. Thank you.